Now, I'm calling one more number here today. And it's the comedy store in Los Angeles, California. Somebody better answer the phone. <laughs> there we go. You can't get anybody serious to answer a damn phone in 2021. That should be your most important hire. Then don't have it. Don't have a phone. Don't have an answering system. Just have a web. Hello? Hello, comedy store. Yeah, can you get me off speaker, please? Um, no, I can't. I'm, I'm using my hand. You got to get me off speaker. I'm with the news. I'm with the New York Times. Okay, I mean, I can't right now. I'm in the middle of a bunch of stuff at work. This I is am. insane. Are you a doorman at the comedy store? I am, yeah. Don't you want to, you know, work your way up and become a comic one day? This is no way to treat a higher up. Um, I mean, I'm not mistreating you. I've been answering the phone on speakerphone with everyone. Because yeah, I know. It sounds I'm awful. It sounds awful. Get one of those Madonna headsets. You could do both. Now, what are you doing yeah, with your hands? Sure. What are you doing with your hands that is more important than talking to me? Hello? I'm just not cut out to talk on the Someone phone. Someone says this is with a place people. in Austin that will guarantee the answer. Yeah, the last new, number. Okay, one more call. It must be me. I'm just not a good conversator over the phone. Can you believe this? Every place you call on the show, I've been trying to do prank calls for months on the show. You Every time. call back the comedy store in a couple hours. To see it, and report I, that guy. Well, I want to ask them about Tony. Yeah, of course. He's too busy. There we go. We got another call here. Hi, Nick. I'm glad this is Carson. How can I help you? What, what did you say the name of the business is? Uh, Planet K on Guad. Of course. Do you know, are you familiar with this business, Antones, on your street? Uh, say that again? Antones, the blues club. Do you know Antones? Yeah. Do you know about this racist incident with their guy, Tony Hinchcliffe? Have you heard of this? A racist incident? Yeah. Did you? Do you know Tony Hinchcliffe? Uh, no, I do not. Do you know Joe Rogan? Uh, yes. So you know Joe Rogan. Do you know I moved to Austin to do comedy? Yeah. So they're bringing a bunch of racist comics in. Yeah, they're I'm going to hand the phone to my manager. I feel like this is something that concerns her. Okay. Hi, not in hi. What's up, man? What's, what's the problem, hon? Excuse me? My name's Allie. What happened? Is there something wrong that happened? How old are you, Allie? Why does that matter? Because you're answering the phone like a child. Let's start over. My name is Mark Davenport. I'm from the New York Times. Okay. I'm doing a story on racism in Austin. Okay. We have reports that you know Joe Rogan. I don't understand what you mean. Do you know? Okay, I'll start over. I'm sorry. I'm uh, a little on edge. I've been uh, yelling at people all day on the phone yeah, here Yeah, I can today. tell. You're being pretty rude. Well, you guys are being rude equally. How, what, how was I rude to you at any point, sir? Uh, you're being rude right now. I'm um, asking you a question. I'm not being rude to you. That's rudeness. Uh, also, the girl who answered the <laughs> really? phone. Yes, that's rudeness in my book. The that's way you're true. talking to a man. I'm a man. You're supposed to bow at my feet. You understand? So this is a prank call? No, this is a misogynist call. I can tell, which to me is a joke. All right, let's start can over. You want to me? start over? Can we start over and uh, start from the beginning? We'll try it again. I'm sorry. Miss? She hung up too? Hello? This is insane. I mean, really, the world's... This is what I mean. You can't work with this world. This you world is done with us. This world is start over. Off a little nice. They and don't get them care. To, no, next time you call the comedy store, you got to be nice. At nice first. schmice. Somebody's calling a business. I should be waited on hand and foot. <laughs> what if I'm in a very important businessman? I want to spend ten million dollars here. You think Japanese businessmen are calling up and going, "Hi, I just want to make sure I'm a businessman. I'm Jewish. I have things to do." Back in the day, if you called a restaurant, hello, how can we help you? I mean, they would be so concerned. Now it's all these bitches. Hi, yeah, we're busy. They treat the phone as if it's, uh, you know, kids throwing eggs at their house.
you know, wasting their time. But I do want to know these what people. the comedy we will, we'll call in a little bit. Boston. We'll call in a little bit. The whole show can't be me trying to get through to somebody on the phone. I'm going to have incident after incident I because agree. I can't get past. Trust me, I'm with that you. That part. 